Hey guys, what is up? It's Jamie, Farnsworthy Vending. Listen, we're about to go pick up about 10 full line machines. This is going to be one heck of a trip. I'm pretty stoked about it. Before we move on, guys, I want you all to remember real quick, um, this channel is funded by Patreon. Go into the description below and click on the Patreon link to check it out. Thank you so much. Let's move on. Peace. Hey guys, what's up? I literally like just rolled out of bed. It's a Thursday right now. Tomorrow is about to be one of the most hectic days ever. I'm picking up 10 soda machines. Well, not soda machines. I'm picking up 10 soda and snack machines. And it's... <laughs> Eight of them are gonna wind up in my garage for the time being, but I'm gonna document every little bit of it. So right now, uh, because I need to rent a truck that I wasn't expecting to have to rent, um, I'm gonna run out to every single location I have, grab money, and uh, try to make sure that I've secured enough funds to make it happen. All right guys, so this was just a quick collection real quick, um, like four, why do I always say that? Quick collection real quick. It's just like four machines, grabbing everything. We got a whole bunch of change here. But uh, let's move on. I got to run to Ryder. So after collecting on the machines, I literally like just barely had enough money to make this whole deal work. Uh, so I set out. I went and I grabbed the Ryder truck, and we went down and started picking them up. I got as much footage as I could, and uh, we'll roll right into that now. So that's our. With the P. That's. I think that's a GPL. I'm not sure what this one is. This is a National or an AP. It's a good sized machine. Looks clean enough. Cool. Do you got some power so I can just plug in and check this one? Alright, so we got this guy in the truck. Got a lift gate out back. Then we got this guy and get a better look at it it's kind of nasty we're gonna have to clean this one a trusty dolly 10 bucks to rent that thing all right guys so this is the actual pickup this is a pretty decent machine i think this is the usi so we thought that this was this is definitely not a dixie narco this is a royal 660 and uh, pretty sure the bill validator out of this guy might work in there. Uh, not 100% sure what this machine is, but we'll find out. We'll get it cleaned up. We'll get it working. To, uh, I think it went through a rough spat on the last move. We've got our soda slave. So there's only one combo machine. The other part of it's right there. But we'll start getting all this loaded up, and then we'll get some more footage later. All right, guys, we got them all loaded up. We've got, this is the one going to Claremont Subaru. We got this one. Uh, this one needs work, definitely. Uh, this is a big boy. I, I'm not really sure what it is. I'll show you the keypad. Maybe someone can tell me. Um, this one might actually work. It's got a good bill acceptor in it. Um, all of these have CoinMax every one of them so I've at least got money in parts this is the uh, row it's kind of hard to see this is the row it is actually junk so we're going to sell it for parts this is part of our combo machine that's our soda slave this is our cold food machine stand back a lot of you guys ask about dollies and this thing just saved my back so much but we're off to coke now see you guys in a bit Guys, I'm freaking out a little bit because I don't think I strapped one of the machines in. didn't but it didn't fall over. I might get up there. Man, I'm lucky as hell. I guess it really wouldn't hurt an important machine, but 
Man, I'm lucky. <laughs> I'm going to get this sucker strapped in. We'll get back on the road so we can head to Coke. All right, I'm just going to record like this because I know I've got the phone right now. So this is what the truck looks like now. We've got a couple of Royal 660s. We've got our whole lineup. We're about to offload this guy and this guy at a location, pick up an older Dixie Narco, and move their snack machine around back. All right, guys, let's get to it. Alright guys, so we just got this bad boy for free, um, older Dixie Narco, I think, but, uh, compressor's no good in it, I'm not sure if I'm gonna do anything with it at all, or maybe try to sell it for like 25 bucks or something, get it out of there, pull some parts, whatever, sell some parts out of it, scrap it. Alright, hands are a bit shaky, sorry, you guys were right, shouldn't have done this alone, alright, we'll move on. Getting everything set up. Uh, fix these two into this space. All right, we got these secured, looking good. Definitely need to be cleaned. We'll be back to clean. <laughs> Hi guys, we're back at the house. I have the regular camera again. Oh, why are you being a butt? I gotta get this thing off. This is the lift gate. I gotta get this sucker. Bam. There we go. That's better. Oh, we're back at the house. We're gonna get all these machines in front of my garage because my garage is a mess right there. I gotta fill it, I gotta clean it up pretty good before I can move anything. But going up. Oh, it's gonna be nice to get like an actual shot of these things with the camera. Oh, you still can't see anything. We got the Pepsi machine. We got the, wow, never mind. I'll just pull them all out and then we'll get a shot. <laughs> Whew, guys, I'm so tired. So before it gets too dark, I just wanna show you guys what today's pickup was. Um, this isn't all the machines either. I had four go straight to locations. So I actually, I don't know what this machine is. Um, let's see if we can find a tag somewhere. I don't see a tag. But I think this machine might work. Um, we'll find out later. I'm going to get it pulled inside. So if anyone knows what this is, let me know. Because I don't. Oh, maybe this will tell us. Oh, look at that. It's a USI. Cool. USI is good. I've heard good things. We got ourselves a nice row here. So if anyone needs any parts for a row, I've got parts for rows. I'm not using it. This is a, step back a little bit, this is actually a combo machine, both of these together. Um, that's the Soda Slave, and then this is our USI, I think U. wait no it's not USI, I think this is Crane, I think this is a GPL, I don't know, we'll find out later, but I, I think this is USI, maybe, we'll find out. We got this Dixie Narco, pretty sure it's a Dixie Narco. <laughs> It's got uh, it's got a blown compressor. Um, this is a GPL crane. Got a good old Royal 660. I love these things. They're awesome. Oh look, there was a drink in there. <laughs> That's probably why they're so hard to move. Um, this is a GPL cold food machine. So. I'm pretty stoked. I'm really excited. I gotta bring that behemoth back to where it came from. 
and then I got to clean out the craft slash business room that's a mess. Just clean that out so I can get these machines in there and organize the garage in general. But, all right, guys, we'll talk to you later. All right, guys, so I've gotten home. We've gotten everything sorted out and put together and in the garage. Boy, that was a rough day. I'm tired. <laughs> so uh, this has a location already. Needs a little bit of work. There's some, there's a mouse or something in here. So it's got to be cleaned. It smells rough, so i got to pull everything out and clean it real good. But I'm pretty sure that this machine is working right now, so with a good clean, it'll be all set. This is a USI. Um, not really sure. I think it'll say on the inside. It's a USI Smart Snack 3 Smart Snack 3 4000 3014A. And we've got another Royal 660. These are my favorite machines. We need a bill acceptor in this machine, and that's all that I can really tell at this point that it needs. It does have a location. You guys have already seen this one, but uh, this one has a location. We got the new coin acceptor in it, and uh, now it just needs to be cleaned. So that's pretty close to running. This is an old row. The row, from what I understand, went out of business a long time ago, and there are pieces of junk now. So we're going to strip it, sell the parts, and crash the cage we got a uh, this is I gotta back up a little bit this is a combo machine these two machines here this is also a USI model um, it's almost identical to the machine that we have in the laundromat only a lot prettier so pull all these off but yep so I'm excited about this machine we're gonna find a location for this machine and it will be good to go this guy right here is a cold food machine. Um, I doubt that I'm going to put this into service, but I have someone who might want to put it into service. We have a digital display here. Ah, that's where the bill acceptor goes. Okay, so it needs a bill acceptor. Um, we got this machine for free in that run. They just wanted to get rid of it. Um, I took the coin acceptor out of it. Uh, there's probably some other parts I can get out of it, but I don't really want too much right now. Uh, this is the old green and purple machine. I have decided that we are going to scrap this machine. going to pull all the parts out of it, and it's going to go to junk. Hey guys, thank you so much for tuning in. We got a lot done today. We got all sorts of stuff put back into place. We got some new locations. Um, I'm going to be doing a couple more videos about filling up the machines and stuff like that in the near future. And uh, we're going to be going back on some more collections real quick here. Um, I had someone request a while back uh, to fill a Dixie Narco machine, show how to properly fill a Dixie Narco machine. Um, I don't have 501E anymore, uh, but I will do a video on filling the old machine that I got for free. So everyone can see that. Remember guys, uh, this channel is supported by Patreon. Please go into the description below and uh, hit the link for me. Check it out. And all the Patreons uh, get early videos and a uh, little more capability to speak with me. All right, guys. Remember to love life and live your dreams. Peace.